Tonight we are making taco tangos. I know you may not know what that is. It's, my husband says it's an Arizona thing. I always thought it was just something that my family did. Turn my pan up. I have two pounds, maybe just more than two pounds. Almost three pounds of regular ground beef. Put this in the pan. Along with this, oh, this is a lot. We will need two packs of taco seasoning. This kind taco seasoning. Unfortunately, the store was out out of the brand we usually use, so we had to get a another bag, another brand. But you just sprinkle this all over the ground beef. If I can get it open. This is really a quick, easy work night meal. Inexpensive. Because it's just like a hamburger burrito with the taco seasoning. And then you add sour cream and lettuce and onions and it makes it yummy. So I'll be back when this is done. Okay, the meat is fully cooked. It only takes about 10-15 minutes really. And now I will show you how we build them. Excuse the camera. I didn't. Sorry. We have chopped up lettuce, onion, grated cheese, fresh jalapeno. We eat lots of jalapeno in this house. I made roasted vegetable salsa. It's tomatoes, jalapenos, onions, and garlic roasted in the oven and then pureed in the blender. Sour cream and for the kids store bought chunky salsa. Now I'll show you how to build them. If I can get my camera set right. Okay. I apologize. Hopefully I can edit that out. I've heated the tortillas on the burner. And these are smaller tortillas, so you just take a small scoop of your meat, some cheese, a few onions. Oh, I hate to use my fingers. And I have picky kids, some like the sour cream and some don't. A little bit of lettuce. Normally we do use tomatoes, but I made this tomato-y salsa and it's so yummy. So we're just going without tomatoes tonight. This is for my daughter, so I'm not putting the jalapenos. Fold it in half, tuck in the sides, and then fold it over. And there you go. A nice taco tango. Thanks for watching.